hello guys welcome back to another video in today's video i'll be trading on uh, with pocket option and also i'll be trading on autism market all right <coughs> okay guys this is not what i advise you to do in any ways right so always stick with real market do not trade with autism market all right i've been doing this for a long time and i i've been having a very good result trading with this particular market here call commodity all right so just come over here and call commodity so you can check what's it called <coughs> the trade over here all right so um this is the four what's it called market available on the commodity right so let's just go ahead and see um if you can make money what's it called if you can actually um close the trade with this um i do not use indicators with this kind of strategy i mean with this on my head i just go ahead and analyze my what's it called I analyze my candy and then i go ahead and pick a trade on it all right it's not something that use an indicator or signal for they're not just gonna work it just needs to have the um, what's it called the experience and all before you just go ahead and trade so that's just it guys so guys i'll be doing this on a one minute and on 30 seconds candlestick all right so keep note on that i'll be doing that so let me just another thing i'll be showing you is that i'll be um what's it called i'll be showing you how i pick a trade i'll study a particular candlestick then i'll definitely gonna see if it's gonna be the right candle for me to stick a trade on all right so you need to be very what's it called you need to be very careful and make sure that you and watch this video to the fullest so that you can understand everything i do here all right <coughs> because i'm watching on this candle i want to see if it is gonna be the best candle for me as you can see it's getting stronger but keep pulling up what well, is all to see so that is what we can definitely gonna expect so let me see if it's gonna be the best candle all right okay i'll be doing it on 50 dollars right I usually trade very low on all this market, so I'll be trading on fifty dollars. So let's see. Okay, I get what's it called. I get late on this candle. Glove pick a trade on these, but let's keep watching that. Let's go ahead and check another one. Okay, I think. Alright, I'll, I'll be picking this trade to go up on this candle. So let's see. All right, I got um fifty dollar on there, so let's see if we're gonna win the money. Um, the reason why I actually place a trade here over here, I realize that this is a very strong kind of stake, and actually generate this. It actually gonna get so weird over here, but not really matter. So I think that I'm still gonna have additional strong kind of stake on a buy option here. That's why I actually go ahead and pick that. So let's see if we're going to win the money. Okay, we lost that on that. So let's keep checking. See, so definitely I'll double my trade right now. I'll take my time to study a candle. Okay, it's not good. Let's keep pulling now. Let's go back here. See? Okay, are we doing this? Come down. Okay, I double the trade. So let's see if we're going to be in the money on this too. Okay, we're right back money on that. So let's go back to our 50. And then let's search. Okay. I'll be taking care of what's it called. I'll be watching this particular candle here. I want to see if it's definitely going to be a good thing. Okay, I'll be taking a down trade on this. So I'll I'll take it down to the nice. So the reason why um the over here the candle is getting weaker, 
all right so i decided to pull uh what's it called sell option trade on it to come down so let's see if we're gonna win the money on days after one minute All right, we're back on the money on that too. So let's go ahead and see. Like I said earlier on, this is out to some market. This is not something you can do. Or this is not something I advise anyone to do. Um, yes, you even all know that I'm trading with a very small amount of money. And it, when I lost that on days that I actually doubled the trade and try to keep the money back. So that's just all the strategy I'm using here. So it's not something you can just jump in doing, right? So that was the reason why. So let's see if we're gonna have some more strong signal. I'm actually watching days because it's actually really falling down here, but it keep pulling up. But it's something I can actually watch to see if it's gonna be lucrative for me to put money on. So I'm sorry this particular candle over here. So let's see if I still have the same energy, then I can go ahead and play the trade on the next one. Alright. Or perhaps I can shut the trade off to go up. So let's see if if we're gonna be the money. Or if it's gonna be the right candle, right? So I'm just starting this out right now. So let's see. Okay, the candle is getting a little bit weaker. And um I will put in it to go up. Alright. Okay, let them expect this. I put it up to go up again. Okay, I got placed, so let's see if we're gonna win the money on this. Alright, guys, when I'm winning on that again, okay. Let's see if we're still gonna have. Okay, I'm having a very good one here too. So I hope if I'm still getting these, then I can actually go ahead and play the trade. But you can see the candle is even getting weaker. All right. I must well play the down trade on this. So let's see. Okay, I go place that. So let's see if we're gonna win the money. Okay, that was a very bad one. We lost that on there. All right, when I get um over here, I get a very pull down down here, as you can see. I get a very pull down over this candle. So I thought that I'm gonna have. I'm the same energy going down here, so I actually place a down trade on it, but it goes back again, then starts stringing back again. So that's just the OTC market for you. Okay, let's go ahead and double the money again to see if you can actually get back. I was a call, take back the lose, and then let's see. Check this out. Now the other thing, you know, um, what is the market does usually is follow the counting instruction. Over here, I gave it to be on a 30 seconds, if you can see. But the candle itself is on like, um, what's it called, 20 or 10 seconds. They keep generating as the way they like. So that's the autism market for you. They're not a real market and they have a total control of what is happening to themselves, right? So I, it's not something I advise anyone to trade on. Right, it's a set of standard number and something I advise you to trade on if you are not what's it called? If you don't have the experience, do not just do it. All right, this doesn't actually work with any signal or any kind of a thing, it's just all to say, right? So let's I'm be taking trade on days because the candle is not actually giving me enough pro. But let me say, contact trade on days to come down, okay? Yeah, I think it will. 
a big trade on this to come down. The reason why is that this candle is getting weaker and I have I have a very strong candle that generates this. But when it's that have to pull up, it's getting weaker by moving up. So I think that it's still gonna come down in the next one minute. So that's why I put um, the down trade on it. So let's see if we're gonna bring the money. Okay, guys, we're in the money on that. All right, it's very uh, that was a very very closed one. So we're in the money still. All right, guys, um, this I'll be stopping on this trade. As you can see, this is how I trade on autism market. Majorly, I take a trade. And when I lost out of the trade, I'll double the money, then go ahead and pick the trade again. So that's how I do it. All right, so let's go ahead and see how I'm gonna trade you taking so far. Right. Okay guys over here we take um what's the call? We take a one, two, three, four, five, six. I think we take a five trade. I mean the six trade. The first one is on lose. So we double the money back, we take it back over here on this hundred dollars you can see. Uh, the second trade, um what's it called? The third trade, we got the money on fifty dollar trade and the fourth trade too the same thing. The fifth trade we lost that out. And then we double it and we get it again on the last one all right so guys this is where i'm gonna stop on today's video this is how you trade or should i say this is how i trade on autism market majorly on the commodities right so it's like i said it again this is not something i advise anyone to do it's not something that even though you want to do it make sure you're using your demo account to do the practice and all all right this is just something i do on during the weekend to just picking some money and i don't put a lot of money on that i put just a 50 dollars and then when i lost that on the 50 dollar i go ahead and double it to make sure i cover the loose so this is how i do it all right so thank you guys for staying up and if you love the video please give me a thumbs up comment and um i'll see you on monday i'm gonna resume fully on trading back on monday right so i'll be using my kind of my private um strategy henceforth and if you want to get that just message me and just send me a message and we're gonna talk about it all right guys thank you so much and i'll see you uh i'll see you on monday